cable out of the wall if you can see this icon. Space, begin experience. Thank you for your purchase. Store now open. Struggling with a puzzle? Why not visit a sci-fi store to purchase a premium inventory and make your adventure a little more you? We are aware of bugs persistence when it jumps on Ben's head, causes Dan to glitch on the ground a little beyond this. Let's see what the store looks like. Thanks for visiting the sci-fi store. It'll be a great place to stock up a premium. Help you through some of the game's trickier puzzles. We're not quite ready to bring it online yet. yet. Pay us a visit when we launch. Never. I think that's a joke. Let's take a look at the game. Dialogue. Verbosity. Full waffle, yes. Accessibility. Dyslexic friendly font. Okay, let's turn that off. Font size, let's make it a little bigger. Brightness and lightness of dialogue. Bigness or littleness of dialogue, okay. I'm gonna make it a little bigger. Black behind dialogue. Let's see how that looks. Nope, doesn't work. White dialogue. Does that work? Okay, type speech. Should dialogue be typed out as spoken or appear one method? Type speech. So speaker name, no. Auto progress speech, colorblind mode, no. Camera noise. Screen shake, sure. So that's all accessibility features. Let's turn that off too. Auditory. Music volume, FX, MBN's voice. That's all good. Turn it up slightly. Controls. A, D, W, S, space jump, E, push. Shift, interact, aiming. Right mouse button, okay. Cycle left. Cycle hotspots. Shoot. Okay. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Visual. 1920 by 1080. If I do that... Okay, it makes it smaller. Which is not good. Visual is there, back, back, and let's start the game. Here we go. Peru. Two weeks ago. I hate this already. I'm not doing any platforming. Talked about this, Ben. Pointing and clicking is dead. So it's trendy platforming kids we're in now, and we need to stay relevant. I'm going to be on an, an itty darling platformer instead. You prance around all you like, Dan. I'm gonna stick to to stick with what I know in my hands, and something sometimes in my mouth. So then, which super villain are you going to defeat when you're amazing so many jumping skills? Actually, we're looking for a flower. What? This isn't one of your wacky adventures, Ben. It's a point in quest. This is rare and most likely metaphor flower that cures cancer. You can't even get more worthy than that. What? Uh-huh. To find this flower, presumably we find a wacky florist. And swap it in, swap it for a more expensive arm. No, we use it to cure our friend Matthew. Has a particularly unpleasant case of color cancer, and he needs colon cancer. He needs our help. It's not very. It's not. Oh, bloody hell! Right, we've done enough of your old-fashioned talking already. 
I gotta read faster. I'm going on ahead. Have fun with your brain. You wait there, I'll run ahead and I'll call you if I need your help. Phil six. This lever is too small and nimble for my colossal hands. All right, maybe I need your help already. Hey Dan, which mat is this? Answer anyway, Matt F. No, no, Matty. Hmm, shame. Gasp. Don't be so callous. We're being thoughtful. Q news. Hello, sir. That was a floaty monolith thing. Checkpoints. When we die, we're respond at the last checkpoint we cross. Standard platform procedure. Death is not consequence free. Far being a mild inconvenience. Why can't Massey so just respawn them? Not only is all pathos and heartstrings. Oh well, he's not a platformer, it's different. Our dissonant. Dissonant. Oh, just a cold, dark void with no concept of time or space, basically. Yikes. Some platforms are so emo. They have to go through this at every two minutes. Yeah. Well, back to it. Make it across if we work together. For a dark, mysterious jungle, this place is positively bustling. Hey. You there, hippie. Look a bit uh, cluttered for a platformer. Thanks for <laughs> actually my mom. From our six And you are? Uh Ben. I'm from Point and Click. Oh charming. I remember those. Uh-huh. What's your game about? So What are you out here doing on the front lines? What's the doing out here on the front lines? These are for my next game. Flower around here somewhere. Okay. We have power to cure cancer. I'm going to use it as inspiration for my next interactive narrative experience. I think I should start recording. That's about that worthy shit show. A rival project, eh? Well, I certainly welcome healthy competition. Good luck getting over these impassable spikes, though. What is your game about? The dissection of loss due to cancer. <laughs> As an engaging perspective mechani mechanic, where objectives can change sides depending on dead axis value. And it's going to serve as a protagonist. <laughs> it's a bit narcissistic, don't you think? Interesting opinion, but I'd like to think autobiography games are super innovative. Why do you talk so weird? So are you gonna get moving or what? Can't see through your massive beard. Struggling to get over this pit of spikes. Developing a walking simulator, not a jumping simulator. Why do you talk so weird? Or you might write a negative steamer. <laughs> Get back to work, you lazy dev. Donkey donkey, have a productive day. Oh, what? I thought I was... 
Honky donkey, poo, 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 poo. If I use him, can I talk to you? No, I can't. I have a feeling I'm gonna die here. Maybe I need to go back and stand on this thing. Does that do anything? Nope. Maybe that does something, actually. Let's try that. This lever. Nope. Use inventory. What's this? Liquid carrying device. Pressing on, to be honest, but I only press on two places toilets and graves. <laughs> It is 10.38 where I'm at. Skip dialogue line is period. Switch between Dan and Ben. I'm pretty sure if I step here, I'm going to die. I'm not walking off the edge of this ledge. I'm going to custom to gravity, okay. Yep, that definitely kills you. Okay, cool. Nope, can't make that. Alright, let's see. What are we going to do? Hey Marcus, um, oh, 6.30 a.m. All right, see you later, bro. Thanks for dropping by. So I can't jump off that, but I should be able to use something to, let's see, is there anything back here that I can use? Uh, doesn't look like it. I can't sprint. No double jump yet. So there's that. Let's see, does that do anything? Nope. Can I talk to this guy? No, I can't. Oh, I can push. Okay. Okay, X to close. Come on, come on, stop posing and get a move on. Some people want to use the course. <laughs> oh wow. We just killed the dev. Examine from afar. Hey, nice shoes. I think they're platform shoes. Oh, dang it, messed up. The jump. Just the James Bond. Platforming is the coolest. To get big things happen. Just stand in the right place and wait. Hmm. I'll stick to jabbing at things with my fingers, ta. I want to see where... Oh, okay, so it's done. God, there are too many objects in front of me. It's never happened to me before platforming got involved. Better have a big think and decide which one of these to interact with first. Bubble pipe. Not that thanks. Uh, indie development. Extreme sports like indie development. Nice boots though. They're huge, but what? Look at their fit, Dan. They've got boots. Three minutes in, and you're stealing shoes off a dead man. Some things don't change, do they? Yeah, I'm trying to cure cancer here. Okay, that's his inventory. Combine. Will that work? Nope. Nope. 
none of those work. Actually, I want to try one other thing. So I've gotten everything from him already. Doesn't look like I can get anything else. Oh, okay. We're gonna hear each other over any distance now. It's a light telepathic bomb we picked up. You're in the warlock to the Stonehenge invasion incident, remember? Where each archway led to different planes of myth. There was a lot of vague mystical wiffle waffle in that adventure. That creek looks movable. Yes, pushing crates. There's a bill. Like that's exhilarating. What's up here? Nothing. Oh, there's stuff up. You know, it's a different color to the rest of you. It's really disconnecting. Okay. Those that are a different color from the rest of your face are in so are so in right now. Even though it makes no sense. Well, your nose looks like it's from a different game entirely. Oh, don't want to do that. Will it come back? Yes, it will. to do. So I need to do something with that. Maybe I missed something over here. Just does that. Fiddlesticks. Way too high for my current platform or skill level. My boring single jump skills aren't gonna cut it. I need some sort of double jump upgrade in order to progress. Uh, yeah, I had a feeling that would do that. touch it from there. Hmm. Okay, so far... Maybe... Oh, I know what I can do, I think. It's a power source. Hmm, I'd be able to somehow. Oh, stand on, I see. Here's my inventory items on it.
second now I should be able to get him to stand on it. Press the jump button all you like. No platformer. Or <laughs> resolutely refuse to engage any kind of. Let's use uh, the power source. A force field yonder. That doesn't even make sense, you know? Why are th all these platforms and buttons and stuff in this jungle? It's uh, surrealist. It's slapdash, is what it is. I don't like it. Let's just agree to ignore any technology from here on out. It's ruining the vibe. It's jammed shut. Might be able to get it open. It's all satisfying way for something sturdy. And ideally something rubber so I don't get electrocuted. Here's some Willy. Can't just pick that up. I'll get electrocuted. Just get a sturdy whack with something non conductive. Some more well hey no recycling jokes. Hey, uh -uh. hey no recycling jokes until the next level at least. Yay. Uh, pick up. I was leaking a particular volatile acid. Good job. My fingers can't feel pain, or this might be jolly sore. Told you'd find walking easier. Once you took your hanky on a stick out of your pocket. Like my old walkie. It was so jovial. Oh, that's the glitch. Yep, there it is. Power function of so it's all like it's not mistaken. No lace is the bloody hipster. Examine. Bubbly pipe. Went on our adventure, but it's not worth it because you never come across soapy water. Why all the adventures have mucky fingernails? Like platformers, though. Now I have a splashing around in a giant bathtub before long. So here it is. Can't blow bubbles while it's dry, though. Alright, cool. A physical representation of my urinary brow, <laughs> which I actually keep somewhere between my kidneys and my John Thomas. But I was pleasantly full of bursting at, uh, at this moment in time. Okay. Fantastic, I think all of the lines. This is classic jungle adventure stuff. I'm gonna have to work out some way of getting through them. Maybe something in my inventory can help. Ruby lines, they're far too strong. Weaken them somehow. Can't get these out of my hands. I'll look ridiculous. Well, my weird. <laughs> Sorry if I. This is a messy slide. Aha! That's a 
battery is going to come in pretty useful, I can tell. Uh oh. Some sort of jumping beast monster up there. Dan, use your platforming skills and jump on that damn thing, will you? Okay, I need you to go over here. First, you need to get the tentacles. Examine. Looks like the jumping trumpet. But still works. Just with this head pop and leaving the creature itself alive, but it's horrific, Agni. Ugh. Important point is the jumping mechanism definitely still works. Pick up. Find it to my inventory. To play a jumping beast will long thin arms like shoelaces. Alright. I need two of them, I think. I keep um, using the Q for not switching between them, but uh, I keep pressing Q to switch between them, rather, so I should say. Talk to? Anything to talk about? No? Okay, cool. thing. Another sentient creature murdered by Dan in his humanitarian quest. It's two jumping creatures with, oddly enough, the same number of feet Dan has. Telling them about how many feet I have? Yes. Is it still two? Yeah, still two. Hurrah, massive triumph. Successfully created a... Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? What? I'm combining objects in my inventory just like I always do. Ugh. Look. You're going to insist on sticking to old, boring 1995 ways of doing things. At least call it crafting from now on. That's what all the kids are calling it now. You want that bloody thing or not? This unstable marriage of unsafe, untested technology should help Dan bounce around the place. Plus, the laser should keep him tight on his adorable little size five feet. Oh god, that's funny. Not putting them on. Some other idiot into wearing. There you go, I combined you up some double jumping boots. Oh look Ben, what a lovely handy new item you've crafted there. Fine, I've crafted some double jump boots for you. Here. I mean, jumping is ridiculous as it is, but these boots would be so second preposterous. Mid-jump. Jump. So you can reach higher heights than ever before. Uh-huh. And you do that every time you put your shoes on, do you? Ow. Uh, let's see, what is this? Some sort of totem pole. I want to get close enough to investigate it. I'll need some sort of periscope to breathe through. Ah, I see. The pipe. The gas doesn't get me. Is 
it's uh, for the, the switch I can press. It's off now. I guess it's first. This should be safe. What does that do? Okay. Do we do not? To, it's requires someone sturdier, like that. Also use all sorts of swinging and turning and stuff to get past this bit. Oops. up there. Hey, Dad. Something glinting back there. Oh, hey. <laughs> Another one of those crates. These crates. This is your brave new world, is it, Dan? Crate pushing. Ventures have been doing that since at least 2003, mate. Aha. Uh -huh. But they're not symbolic or psychological blocks when you do it. It's just not as cool. Oh, squishes you too? There. Nope, can't get up there. Some phrase as a question. Oh, it's down. I can't push it. Huh. Yeah, that's a that's an interesting
Yeah, it's neither. I don't know if you didn't notice all the stuff. That's rare so much. People say I have a mouth like a toilet. Mm. That's the test, actually. Buckle up, buddy. <laughs> that is the first thing I said about me. Hold E. I can't. What did they say about it? Great pushing. So it's not as cool. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. I think I need to use the battery to melt the. burn holes and everything. This adventure will be done in a jiffy. Goal is 19. How are you pushing that entire crate of it? Yeah, my big beefy platforming hands have made me inhumanly strong. Or it's gold plated. Something, something. Okay. I'm gonna have to pull it back because I need him to go over top of it. it to be over here and I need you to yeah. I think I messed up I'll need to die can. Options. Quit. Yeah, defo. Let's see what happens. So I have to go back in. Hopefully, it loads me at that checkpoint. That's not saved. So I can get that fixed. Chapter select. Let's see what continue gets me to. Um, 
Nice. So it hasn't been done yet. From the rope. But we'll have to use all sorts of swinging and trigonometry and stuff to get past this bit. Now we can get to and pull loads and loads of things on the one side. Jesus help me. Can he get through? No, he can't. So I don't understand what we're supposed to do here. Then. Okay. Uh, what's to examine? Right mouse button. Can't pick up gold. Can I do anything with this? So I need to get up there somehow. How am I supposed to do this? So I can do that. Need you to figure this out for me, buddy. Gives me the option to press Q here, but second god dang it okay I'm stuck damn it Dan why is this game so hard is there any way to get hits here I've got a battery, I've got a pipe, 
Uh, craft. Oh. I can't really swing. Let's try this. Nope. I think I need to have Ben right here. I can't jump on him though. This is a glitch. get you past this. Alright buddy, let's figure this out. Floor switch. Bangle technology. Looks like I use the person's weight. Elsewhere in the world. I get that. My undernourished adventure body is far too weak to put that to the system. Can I do anything with these? It's gotta have something to do with these. Maybe... I need to push it here and we need to attach them somehow. Doesn't seem to be the case. Okay, I think I can push it up. Yep, 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 yep. And that's as high as it goes. Or can I go higher? Can't grab those. Can I throw gold? So we've got that down. I can push the switch with the gold, but I can't get up there.
What are we? What are we doing here? Here's cancer. I get that. What we're doing? Climbing and jumping. I need him to be there, but I can't get him across. Because no matter what I do, he can't walk through there. So it's gonna be something. Because I would be able to make this jump if that was down. But I can't get Ben across. Did I do anything else over here? Nope, it doesn't. Uh, anything in my inventory? No. Nope. Trying to look at everything, but nothing seems to be examinable. Other than the switch. Sparks are coming from the plane. Nothing there. Maybe I need to go back. So I can't go back there.
because he can't walk through that. So I don't know how you get him across. You can pull this. But it doesn't really serve a purpose. Unless... Oh my god, I have an idea. There we go. This desert area of jungle is physically impassable. not in the sky anymore. This whole complicated setup does make sense. Okay, use inventory. Use on. Pretty impressive that this battery is continually leaking acid. I still is presumably going to be a power small airplane. That's the incongruous jungle tech for you, I guess. Careful that front end, it's very spinny. Exactly what I intended to happen. Come on, let's go. chopped off and all that commotion so full of acid is just now in a handy drinkable format instead I have fourth uses a leaky battery. Carry sh shit broken battery on before, but if I'd known they were this useful. to make sure I hold it. Nice, I made it through the tutorial. <laughs> that was intense. Flower. Talk to. Metaphorical, not magic. This is the only flower I've seen so far in this entire jungle. I'm guessing this is the one Dan was banging on about. Rilo, here you go, Dan. The exact flower we need for Mad T's colon cancer. Yes. What I like throws at yes together will muddle through every time. Can we go home now?
right. Here we go. Whoa, London. Two weeks later. I feel like London gets worse every time we come back. I don't remember all this destruction and underlying sense of dread and whatnot. All the apocalypse has come at once. Run, you idiot. We'll stay sheltered forever. I can't run. I'm an adventurer. I might be able to manage quick walking. Well, honestly, that still seems a little fancy for me. You'll have to give me a piggyback ride. No chance of setting that precedent. You'll put near infant concrete slabs in your bundle and jump on the back with a warning. Not an issue. This is an infinite space zero weight inventory. An adventure kit. Hmm, well, okay, let's give it a go then. Stand still while I come up to you and activate you. What? Okay, overbend to pick him up. Guy, you're far too heavy. Be at least partly for you full to point bursting point ladder. Honestly, spent hours and hours on those adventures walking, talking, and using. And you never take a quick wee break. You're gonna do yourself a nasty one one of these days. Go use bladder with a pile of rubble or something. Maybe you platforming brutes relieve yourselves wherever you like. But I'm going to hold on for proper civilized facilities. Thank you so much. Or a grave. I'll always take the opportunity to piss on a grave. Well then, let's find you a grave. Oh, what's this? Entrails. Clown. <laughs> what? Poor guy. My god, the apocalypse must be set at this a bunch of wild animals. And they're running around ripping people apart. Could be unrelated. I mean, everyone hates clowns. My god, the Okay, I don't want to do that dialogue again. Pick up. Ugh, no chance of my picking any of this up. Can't tell what's the intestine, what's Willy. Oh, there's a... Use inventory. Let's use that. I feel like pissing on a clown's entrance would be funny somehow. <laughs> okay. Okay. Fine, well... You guys are hilarious. Alright, I'm gonna come over here. Maybe there's something back here. Oh, whoa, what's this? What? Yes, gravity gone up. Oh my god, this is just everything I ever dreamed it would be. That is so cool. Gravity gone down. Okay. Nope, that didn't work. Alright, we're gonna turn gravity around. Can you walk up this now? Nope. That was cool. Okay, let's see what we can get. Suck. Breathe in some of the helium peeping him up. Which precise will make me much lighter. <laughs> My voice has gone all silly. Mm. Yes, you still look too heavy to lift. Is your bladder engorged? Hmm. 
Let's see, maybe I can pick them up now. Still too heavy. What's your current state? Let me find a way to empty it. Just weed it out. I only weed in two places, toilets and graves. Blast. Technically speaking, this is a grave now. That doesn't hurt me, okay. Oh, still the glitch, so let's try it again. Going left now? Never seen this before. Left gravity, so innovative. Brillo, Brillo, Brillo. There we go. Nice. I should be able to go left now, I think. Nope. How am I gonna get out of this? I can't get out of this. There's gotta be a way. Okay. found it. Never done Satanius pushing. Oh. So I accidentally killed him. But now he can relieve his bladder. Fashion after a toilet they had in the olden days. Okay, I know I get that. Door is open. Step one of a successful week complete. Now for the messy phases. Ah, that hit the spot. You have to build our wonderful light lungs. I can carry you wherever you need to go. And we're talking, taking turns walking like a pair of idiots. All skew. There's no telling where my groinal area would end up. 
You write yourself first, okay. Oh, so close. Okay, I think I know what I need to do. I need to pull this up. And use it. Oh. We can now piggyback. Just like real grown ups. Upgrade. Hooray! Now I can be Ben's personal taxi service, which we won't have to take turns walking anymore. Can I, I can't change gravities this way. Aha! Let me down so I can use that switch. I can't ever go with anything from up here. Okay. It's too erotically. What? I don't know what he said. Missed it. If we don't put you down for this bit, we get us back to the flat in one piece, then you can resume your precious autonomy. Good call. Risk suck me my shoes on anything but apocalyptic. Stop putting your fingers over my eyes, I can't see anything. You're lucky, mate. It's horrible out there. Oh, I ran into the spikes because I was too busy looking at the background. It's pretty awesome the way it looks. Oh, God. Gotta double jump sooner. There we go. Oh. Ow. That's scary. Donald Trump, me too. Man, <laughs> this really is the apocalypse. Oh, what's this? I want this. Can I put you down? No? Okay. No, sorry now. Okay, now. Not helping. This game's so good so far. What the heck is the couch doing up there? Oh, there's like with dialogue, you know? Well, why don't you use some of that dialogue to shut up? What the heck is that? Oh, shoot, I didn't see that spike. There's too much going on in the background that I want to see. And for the small shed, we provide some small sucker against a giant tentacle monster. Slow mo. We made it to the shed. Hiding place, dude. A rickety old shed. Hey, it was this or the toilet, okay? Still out there. Whoa, did a nuke go off or something? What was that? Banging door. 
This door is banging. Agree, it's well wicked. Oh man, this is a neat hat. It's a shiny shield logo on it and everything. Really, really want that hat. Okay. Seems to be stuck to a sticky head. Very sticky hair. Some people just have sticky hair. It's def definitely a thing. Shame because it's such a neat hat. Well. Some of the hairs and loosen the head up. That battery. Oh no. Hmm, close enough. Shield badge has a name on it. Ian Courage, here along for the ride. Welcome aboard, Ian. Guard hat headwear, also head here. Belongs to one erstwhile Ian Courage. Let's see, it's blue. Got a lovely yellow shield on it. A little decorative peak. Wait, and half of Ian's head is hanging out at the bottom. Can I wear it? What does it do? Access. Now oh, the door's broke. These damn apocalypses are weaseling their way in everywhere. There are weasels now too? These apocalypses are getting worse by the second. Take something from here. Can I grab anything? Nope. Still sounding awfully close. Let's try to get underground. So figure out which disaster really super villains behind all this and how to stop them. Or her. The fewer than 5% of supervillains are female, actually. Sexist dinosaur. That would be statistically more accurate. <laughs> what is this? An elevator? That is an elevator. Oh, what the? Whoa, what's this? This has no exit. One of us needs to find the other one end first. There's a lot of weird stuff over here. I have to jump that fire. My legs are still too weak and no nudely for sprinting. Circuits of this office to work up my calf muscles. Take a few months. We don't have that long, it's the apocalypse. Hold on, I'll try and combine you up some steroids or something. Craft them, Ben. We're never going to remain relevant. If you resolutely refuse to use 21st century lingo. There's a fax machine or a computer up there too. Alright. I'm going to bring you with me. Because uh, we need to grab some stuff. Look at. Hooray, these things are all have little descriptions to read. This one says These foots, fossilized footprints show that with no protection, the Bigfoots were viciously wiped out by small predator species. Someone has crossed out Bigfoots and written in Big Feet with a magic marker. <laughs> oh god. Surely it should be Bigfoot. Definitely not. Now I don't want to make them feel inadequate. Oh wow. 
Extra dimensional artifact. Do not stare directly at this artifact, as it has been known to cause temporary madness. Yeesh. Even nailed and unboxed them. I wouldn't even know where to start picking this up. That's too many sides. I don't have enough to add. Leaving this thing well alone. Look at the loss of raptor egg, the fastest of the dinosaurs, yet it still could not outrun their doom. The egg's bouncing around, making it immediately more enticing than all the other stuff. I guess I have to eat the egg. Because maybe one of the apocalypses is dinosaurs coming back. Making eggs wobble. Oh, no, no, I don't want to. Skip, 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 skip. I need to pick this up. Oh, I do love a good egg. Okay. Dinosaurs evolved to the point of developing bifocals. What? <laughs> Yet they could, they still could not see their doom. Whoever this office belonged to certainly trained their employees in dramatic irony. I don't want a massive dinosaur skull. Okay, fine. These glasses might come in useful for magnifying light or. Hang on. Glasses don't have any lenses in them. Oh, uh, the dinosaur is invented by focals and hipsters. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, so good. Oh, that's hilarious. Scrolls from Atlantis. One can roughly translate as climate change is a myth. What? Unfortunately, the Rebe scrolls are too water damaged to be legible. Wow. Oh, God. Jokes. I try as much as possible to avoid picking up boring bits of paper. What's this last thing? I want to see what this last one is. Ancient Atlantean device, batteries not included. Hmm. I'll take it. Uh, no, I know how it goes with these ancient trinkets. Pick one up, suddenly you've got ten of the things. And you're trying to put them all in the right order or whatever. I should spot any Atlantean big purple spinner spanners, I'm steering clear. There's a big purple spanner. Hmm, some sort of ancient portal. Forgotten technology allowing instantaneous operation between two points. Probably safe to use just to give it a go. What's the worst that could happen? Dan, eat this egg. Might give you Velociraptor running powers. No way am I eating a raw egg. So I need to cook it first. Where can I cook it? Uh oh. Okay, you don't fall down, I guess. Can I cook the egg here? But there aren't any buttons to push. Hermione, who said that? It is I, a talking lift. Your intellectual and corporeal superior. A talking lift? Will wonders never cease? So what? You're talkable to? Talkable to? My, my. Seems I was too hasty to rubbish your intellectual powers. Yes, a talking lift talkable to. Go nuts. Take us down, please. Take us down, please. Are you maintenance? Oh, what? Like a janitor? Um, yes, yes, I am. Take me down so I can clean up, please. Password? Go good manners cost nothing? <laughs> Incorrect. Password reset. Replacement password sent to local inbox. Thank you ever so much, Trevor. Really kind of you. Unbelievable. So, we basically need to get up there, and I guess what I could do is I could do this. 
craft. Why would the raw power of this exceptional battery, <laughs> battery man, will produce a long-lasting energy drink, giving the drinker the ability to move with raptor-like speed? I am not eating a raw egg. It's still bouncing around for heaven's sake. Yeah, that's even better. It's free. <laughs> oh my god. Come on, you'll get raptor speed powers. I'll get a stinky bottoms what I'll get. No raw eggs for me. Dang it. Oh, yeah, that was weird. My molecules feel weird. Tiny hot demons. Tiny hot demons? Never seen anything like it before in my life. Uh, pipe? Hmm. Use inventory, maybe... Tell my Rion that we're really putting out fires. Use inventory, maybe the flower? Known cure for cancer? Alright, but no. Alright, alright. Uh, let's use. Oh, L. Hot. I should just do this all day long. I don't think they just jab things into fires with their fingers, Ben. Well, what choice did I have? Do whisk or whatever lying around here anywhere, do you? Hmm. So I need to figure out where to get that thing from. Keep that closed. Um, so the lift is not going to take me down. Oh, it's done. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. The dino DNA combined, uh, I mean crafted, this magnificent battery has produced an astonishing energy drink. If Dan drank this, he'd have raptor-like speed. I assume so anyway. I got a D- in my chemistry GCSE. the drink? Oh, there is. Look, I crafted you a protein shake energy drink combo. Drink up, weedling. You mean to put an ancient rotten egg in some battery acid? Oh, I'm drinking that. You're aware that Mario eats poison mushrooms to go massive, right? Come on, think of England. <laughs> Alright. An arcane potion has given me the mysterious ability of speed. I can leap longer distances and are moderately fast enemies. Alright. Delicious, really? No. 
but I have now acquired an ancient mystical art of running. Which should come in handy. Especially as I suspect that in the near future, I will need to be running very quickly to a toilet bowl. That is pretty fast. Gotta time that better. There we go. Oh no, you my beautiful started to become infected by the apocalypse. Look. I should tread carefully. Oh. Deadly Wessis. My man of action now. Hang on, passes the cerebral as I get. Besides, my hands are far too colossal and muscular for those tiny keys. Wait, shut up. It's massive, heavy old computer. Amazing people used to get by on these things. When was this made? Uh, 2009. Can I use this computer? Not some kind of elite keyboard using hacker. Running primary UI broken. Enabling voice activation mode. Talk to. I don't know where to begin. Uh. <laughs> Impaired. Would you like me to describe breast to you? No thanks. 10 prints, bums, 20 go to 10. Bums, 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 bums. Help. Help. Function corrupted by external impact with floor from great height. Hackers. Read email. One email unread. From left ground, floor, London, entrance. Reads, your password has been reset. Your new password is lifts are the best. Message ends. Oh, this is going to sting. Log off. It's not safe to switch your off your computer. Take us down. Lifts are the best. Apparently. Haha. Uh -huh. Alright, fine. In you come. I'll take you down. Here we go. Good luck, idiots. Wow. <laughs> that goes pretty deep. That goes really deep, actually. Well, I think we're safe from the apocalypse down here for now. That's what says Res Omnis to itself. Let's have a wander. Alright, but don't go too far. Yes, Dad. The galling door is rusted shut. What a boring way to block door suck. Slightly open in the middle. Long and sturdy, I may be able to press that button on the other side. Your penis? <laughs> I said then. Uh, yeah, no idea then. <laughs> Oh, 
brutal, but it's very laggy down here. Like when you go near here, the frames just drop. I don't know why. Scanner. Just go quality. Yay. Yeah, it lags so much. I don't know why. Okay, so I'm gonna... Yeah, it's so much lag here, randomly. I don't know why. There's a lot of lag. Uh, just noticed... A lot of frames just skip. So let's see, what can we use? Open maybe? That's the description lock door. Yes, I get that. Seems to be slightly open though. With the right implement, I might be able to push the access shut button or access button. What do I have in here? I don't have anything. A pipe. Did I forget to grab something? Oh, I can just walk out. Okay. Um, I thought I had to go over there. Never mind. Yeah, it's very leggy down here. It's not like it's using a lot more. I'm not sure why it's so laggy, but it shouldn't be. Oh, what is it doing? I just want to make sure one thing, though. I just want to make sure I'm not recording uh, right now because that might be making me lag. Yeah, I'm not, so it's okay. So it's a random. It's not currently operational. Big underground transfer vehicle. That seems to be deactivated. Hmm. There's power going to be this control computers. It looks like they've locked up. Maybe they run out of memory or got a virus or something. Oh no, Dan was the computer guy. Hey, computers need buttons standing on or gems collecting. I'm your man. Okay. That's yeah, very um Hey Dan, you know how humans see faces in random things? Not that totally looks like a sleeping face. Why would I talk to a monitor? That's madness. What 
least a hundred years old. Could I be doing a really impressed one right now? Any stuff on moving too fast. Like this is where the transfer vehicle will go through. Okay. Near where it leads to. Hope it's not hell, that's place sucks. Thing is stay shut until the transfer vehicle is activated. I have to be a maniac just to wander in. Well I am a maniac. What's this? The thing up. What happened to your straight edge no inventory attitude? Yeah, I'm just collecting. I think floating and shiny as platform is now. Can't do anything with it, it just disappeared off somewhere. Sounds like a Sisyphean nightmare. But fun. Hang on, this computer's just powered up. My transfer was activated. Something after all. Oh well, as long as it just unlocks a new area, that's fine. Don't expect me to start crafting items or anything. Still not gonna talk to it, okay. Well, as an adventurer, I'd say we should blindly jump into this car and head out into the unknown. Unless that's too old hat for you, Dan. Uh, no, that's pretty... S Standard platform procedure too, actually. Okay, so it's a rebooting. Joy. Okay. That's pretty cool. Joy. Oh, interesting. Looks so fun. Classic Sweeter Performing Action. It'll be in, I'll be in my element. Ugh, looks like hard work. Oh, come on. I'm sure we'll manage to muddle through together. I'll wait until you need your fingers. Oh, I need them right away. I don't know, I just feel like it started lagging, the game. Options, visual. Let's lower the settings. Maybe that'll work. Let's try that. Still feels a little laggy. I don't know. It shouldn't be. Use. Oh, I need to be on it first. So I need to use it again. Miles and miles of beautiful platforming. This is pure joy, all right. And it's even got a sponsorship deal with the food brand. How delightfully retro. I'll let you know when I need your fingers. I don't see how I load platforming bullocks. It's so joyous for me. Oh, what the? Uh oh. Uh, oh, alright, this is more like it. Big room for Brillo objects and characters for me to interact with. Whatever this construct thing is, it does good joy. Oh, wow. So you can do both. Welcome to Please Don't Jump or Wall Grab during the contamination process. Kindly identify your platformer. Huh? 
Oh, uh, Benny. Boring. Boring bottom. Welcome board, Benny. Ugh, some sort of gas. This is who performs Afterlife Admin. I think whoever made this construct is taking some liberties with the platform of respawn lore. Greetings. Please proceed to the reincarnation gate. You will be returned to the correct checkpoint. Wait, wait, wait. That's so cute. What's going on? A little disoriented? Perfectly normal. This is a respawn center. Proceed to the reincarnation gate, dispose of any death related items, and you'll be zapped back to the appropriate checkpoint. Based on your cause of death. Your final checkpoint is just before a MK3 drowning hazard. Wanted to respawn there. I guess you'd show symptoms of drowning. What are the symptoms of drowning? Well, you'd be three things. Yes, this is perfect. Go on. Be wet, obviously. And blue, makes sense. And you'd have green seaweed on you. Makes less sense, but okay. Why are you a dinosaur, though? Well, this is the afterlife. And we're extinct, which is like mega dead. So we're the perfect fit, really. Try not to think about it too much. <laughs> Fry your tiny human brain. Don't you have a brain the size of a walnut? That's a myth. You're actually 99% brain. You still have managed to respawn the system. <laughs> They're currently saving your tiny walnut mind. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Have a fun death. Some sort of painter decorator, presumably. I am a uh, Ben Body Burps. Who are you? Violet. So, fellow platform, what's your gimmick? My what? Uh, unique power. Oh. Depending on what emotion I'm feeling, I turn a certain color and get an ability. To look at a sick puppy or whatever. Then I can walk on blue floors. That kind of thing. So you're basically a human mood ring. Cool, eh? If I touch things with my paintbrush, they turn the same color as me. Neat. Metaphor for how our moods affect those around us. Also, I can use the rush for blasting things to death. Ah, oh, there it is. Of course you can. What are your different moves? Red is anger. Obs. Orange is joy. Yellow is yoni. Very good. Just got that. Green is envy. Blue is sadness. And, um, purple is regret. Purple. Oh, who can tell indigo and violet part? Good point. Satisfying. Left side of the road. Yeah, I had this really sad look on his face. Yeah, I've been by a lorry and it's good. It's better all over the pavement. It's crying and then it died. <laughs> Aww. So god, I feel like a Star Trek alien. To attack you for you. Cutsy animal mascot. They're really scraping the barrel now. Oh, my name is... Whatever it be. Screech. Huh? Yeah. Because you were... You'd be able to talk human. Eesh.
look at. Generic forgettable platformer. Hasn't even got a recognizable silhouette. Hey, oh what? Hi fellow platformer. Um uh it's Benito Bansarao or whatever. Who the hell are you supposed to be? A Spartacus spanner. I run around jumping from platform to platform. Fixing leaky pipes, fixing broken droids, that kind of thing. Uh, and that's what the spanner's for? Oh no, that's for bashing things to death. Of course it is. What are you, some sort of uh, hedgehog? Oh, the spikes. Oh no, these are my manner of death. This time, uh, particularly for the late jump in the inevitable side ice level. Got them jammed in tight. Oh, there's three for the taking? Forgive me, I'd have nicked uh, one of my way path if I'd known they came away. So I'll need to deposit them at the reincarnation game before I re spawn. If you yank the spike out of me. Really? No bonus. Why haven't you gone through the reincarnation? My name's Spartacus Spanner, so see, but in certain territories I'm known as Monkey Ranch Mike. It's perfectly standard, but I keep getting told it's discrepancy. So I'm filling out Form 37 next. It's taking bloody age. Is that a hollow spanner? Sure is. Latest 20th, 31st century tech fits in almost any size of nut bolt or whatever. So hold it close and it just auto adjusts. Wow, your job is very boring. Cheery diddly bye. Stuff you then. No, nothing. So talk to of course it's Diana Diana Nikas very clever joke but since Jurassic Park came out no one gets it Diana Nikas Diana Nikas Diana Nikas Diana Nikas hmm Blue, wet, and covered in green seaweed. Okay. Sounds like a plan for me. Goodbye. What the? Come on, where's my mouse at? There it is. Okay, I'm just gonna do that and get it back. Also, so noticed that. Uh, Already blue. I need green and who's this guy? Look at who gets to respawn and when. Pass some sort of dumb exam first. Ready to return to the land of the living now, please. Ta-da! Ta-da! Check. So I can't. Back and everything. Drop it off just before the reincarnation gate. Grappling over my back the whole time I'm stuck here. Sorry. Characteristic is uh, that I absorb the pain of others. The metaphor. <laughs>
Huh? Go back. Give it back. I did not have such thing. They did it right in front of me. Well, it's just your word against mine, I'm afraid. Oh, forget it. I'm not gonna give that to a wild animal. Talk to. I'm not getting anything useful out of this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pipe down. Envious, I think, is. I saw a game mechanic once where you could send objects forward or backward in time. So, a chunk of dinosaur flesh would become oil. Is that how oil works? Yes. It definitely is. Because I'm super envious. Bye bye. Killed by a simple spike. Okay, that's painful. Kinda of leggy here. Okay. I want to see what this um Thank you. 
Okay, I'm trying to figure out. Back here. You gotta time it right. We get to the last one, like, uh, gotta keep running. I'm missing them so badly. Made it. Thank you. 
Oh man, come on. I'm not very good at platformers. Overshot it. That should be just right. Ah, oh, come on, man. Oh. I need to see those spikes. What the? It's killing me up here. Oh, there's spikes there. Okay. That Velociraptor speed is really doing me in. Oops.
So I need that seaweed somehow. Just to get out here. So this place also has this other third floor to explore. Just need to cycle through the portals a little more. Winged dinosaur thing. Are you one of the personnel I need to see about? I don't work here. Oh, I just assume because you're a dinosaur. I'm not a dinosaur, I'm a bloody dragon. Well, same thing, you're a all giant lizards. We're completely different. They're extinct and good at office work, and therefore perfectly suited to working in our afterlife administration. A fictional fire breathing and capable of fight or flight, and therefore perfectly suited for platforming. Right, sorry. So, if I need anything setting on fire, would you sort of sort of? What's your name? You have first name Gwe? That's not first name, my surname is T-shirt. T-shirt Gwe. Oh, if you were in a computer simulation, it would be amazing, bad synergy. Huh? Nothing, nothing. Actually, why do you have a torch? Yeah. I exhale propane. I still need to ignite it. What do you expect to walk around with an open flame in my mouth the whole time? Don't be stupid. Makes sense. Hang on. Is that why propane is found in oil then? Dinosaurs exhale propane and oils old dead dinosaurs? Firstly, I'm not a bloody dinosaur. Secondly, oil isn't made of dead dinosaurs. Don't be stupid. Ah. Ah, dinosaurs can fly. Pterodactyls, yeah. Pterodactyls aren't dinosaurs, they're flying reptiles. Oh. We need to do some basic research di on dinosaurs. I really, I do, really do. What are you waiting for at this boring place? That's for. I need uh, an item retention permit for my torch. What? What permit for what? Not an upgrader, eh? When you go through the reincarnation gate, you have to relinquish any causes of death, right? If you get killed by a spike, say you drop it off there. That way you come back to life all fresh and new. The thing is, if you get an ability upgrade, you need to keep it. Oh, like a tied dead animals to your shoes to make you jump higher? Uh, sure. Appreciate reading the fire is a cause of death, not an ability. So I need an item retention permit to let me take it back with me. I've been waiting forever at this blinking desk for it. Wow, performing is more complicated than I thought. What are you waiting for? Okay, well, I'll leave you alone. Well, I'll leave you alone. Don't wait. I want to let the conversation drag on. What the heck is this thing? Sentient fluid. All these other platformers seem way more exciting than anything Dan's doing. Hmm, I wonder if that's the joke. Hey Jabba. Who? Moderately well known platform, Bob the Blob. My power is that I absorb things into my watery guts. Hi Bob. I'm Ben, my power is an ambivalent disregard for the safety of others. Uh, okay. Why are you stuck in this bureaucratic nightmare? Oh, it's something to do with whether I get to keep my collected items. Roll of duct tape C. It's not a cause of death, but I need a special item retention for to hold on to it. So I've got to wait until someone comes along to help. How did you die? There was a sponge. 
Huh, you Wally. Everyone else sponges are deadly to watermen. Not fair, it looked like a lump of cheese to me. Anyway, I dropped it off at the reincarnation gate, but I'm still negotiating over this duct tape. Mind if I plunk my head into your belly? I could do with getting all wet, and it seems like a pretty neat tactic. Things are so but I'm afraid my natural surface tension levels are pretty high. You'd bounce right off. If you want to get wet, I'd recommend a shower. The wrong place. In the maintenance closet. You want to go to a dusty to be over there. Really, thanks, kind Samaritan. Maybe I should have poked him with my fiery stick. Okay. Can't use it on him. Let's see if I can go up here. Ooh, maybe I can get some seaweed from you. Ethlios, Ethliosaur. More fucking dinosaurs. Alright, what's your name? You have freedom of information from her for that. This says the sign outside your office, your name is Lizard. Okay, signs is forbidden. This is the Bijou office. Compact, yes. As we started getting more of your platform was coming through. We'll have to move around. Moved my desk four times already this year. I told Billy that if they move my desk one more time, then I'm going to quit. At least you don't have to move from your desk to Risa. Do you have a permit to create silver lining, sir? I oh, forget it. I'm out of here. Well, a good day. Dan. Let me see tank. Oh god. Uh huh. I listened it. I would ever get sucked. Down there, decontamination chamber. Wait to happen. Thing got destroyed. Okay, some super sticky duct tape. Good to have it perfectly workable. Let's 
Passing the drag on. Need for a mechanic. You could make things big or small. Super innovative. For sure that is conventional. Locking duck and cover. For solo carry and cover, died of a broken heart. I'm trying to get uh, seaweed here. So much here for days. Okay. Okay, so this one. Really need to talk to her. Nope. So I need seaweed. Looking well. And a bit though. And I'll put anyone else's way up high. Lock it down somehow. So nothing I can do with him that would knock it down. Maybe I can tell her something that would get her to do something. I can't really knock anything out.
Oh, don't, don't talk to me before. Okay. There you go. Meh. Underwhelming. Burton for German expression shelf. Contract one is just before MK3 downing hazard. So if you wanted to respond there, I guess you'd show symptoms of drowning. Okay. Hi. Fun death. All right, let's uh, let's respond. Let's respond and when. Apparently I need to pass some sort of thumb exam first. Papers please. Uh, papers. Platformers only. Uh, five platform papers at home. Please let me through. Papers are required. Go to room K30 to get new papers. Next. Ah, oh, god dang it. That's why you don't look much like a platformer. Definitely am. I love it, all that endless jumping and philosophical music. Endless bikes and feeling smug. Top stuff. Right then, I'll just run you through the void jump test. And once you pass that, you can have a fresh set of papers. Right. So, void jump. Good. Great. Alright, I'm going to ask you a series of questions. The select that's it. As simply as you can. Your dinosaur are walking along the sand, when all of a sudden you look down and you see a tortoise on its back. <laughs> oh god. Its belly baking in the sun, beating its legs. Trying to turn itself over, but it can't. What do you do? Then race into it. Jump on it for one up. Thank you. Next complete the sentence platforming is. Oh, what? Dang it. Just try again. That's platforming in a nutshell. Yeah. Platform away. Of course it is. Which, 
which is the best to collect rings or coins? Best to test. Thank you for being a platformer and respecting the rules. Yes, I did do that. I'll just get you some temporary papers and you'll be good to go. Oh, I really try to stay away from boring things like papers. You could just pop me on a list or something. We don't really... I mean, us platformers hate to pick up objects, as you know. Alright, I'll just give the guard downstairs a shout. Hey, Teresa, what? Sending... Sorry, what's your name, please? Uh, Benji Bindle. Oh, wait, thank you. I'm sending Benji Bindle down to you. Just fast the VJ. Just love to know who Benji Bindle is. Stop being such a job's worth and just do it. No papers, you must provide me with visual characteristics to match up. Those are the guidelines. Fine. He carries a bindle. Long and spindly. He's got a giant nose. Um, very well, I'll keep an eye out. You'll have your eye out with this blame. Great call, Chris. <laughs> Sorry about the wait, sir. Everything should be fine now. Oh, great, thanks. Sorry for the bother. Not at all, have a great, have a nice day. Yes, you match the description. Cause no trouble. Oh, suitable disguise. That responds in the level saving all manners of plus trust are after. All the goody good. Dr. Junk. Use me. Final checkpoint. Negatory. Well, that'll do something nefarious instead. Well, it's better to get over though. Hey, you made it. Sure did. What was your half like? Dreadful. Sizing out from running, jumping on heads, and collecting things that went ding. You? Dreadful. Those of meandering around talking to people and stealing things. Help me over this last members. Got it, pal. All those other platforms have jazzy gimmicks. How come you don't have one? You're my gimmick, pal. Keep making cool stuff for me, like double jump boots. Ugh, all my brutal adventure skills. To the platform experience, like so much duct tape. Still, that's very sweet. Thanks, buddy. Struck complete. Simulating data. 
Joy. Sense. Wonder what the the two ninety one counter is. What does that mean? Hello, how wonderful! Thank you for sharing that joyous experience with me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. who are you? I'm the mechanic protector of humanity. So lovely to meet you. I'm connected to all global systems, weather, tectonic, ozone, atomic, and so on. I administrate them, all for optimum protection. Fortunately, recently I had a system crash, which caused all the chaos out there, and also burned my, oh, my RAM. So I can't remember much more than that. Luckily, you two are here now. I can't protect your species properly without fully empathizing with it, you see should be able to keep my local defenses up. So we'll be safe down here, at least for a time. Done full cerebral scans of you both. So with more new RAM, I can create the required constructs for you to go through. Our core emotions that make up human nature. I absorb that experimental data and then I'll have the basic empathy all is necessary to halt the destruction above and protect humanity. I've already learned joy thanks to you, and it's wonderful. Ooh. One down, ten to go, and I'm pumped. But let me get this straight. Yet again, there's no supervillain to blow up, and instead we have to save the world by having a bunch of feelings. How glorious. Don't you start. All you have to do is locate some of my waylaid ram chips, and pop back here for a new construct or two. There'll be a little to no bother. One less boring thing in my way. Let's go, buddy. Piggyback me. I'm tired of this autonomous son of ambulating. So that's not exit one, it's by the other end first. Dental equipment. So it's proper antique. Uh, yeah, push this. Missing a wheel. What the? He needs to be down there. Well, that stuff instantly kills me, but I can't get over there. Hammer dolly. 
Not a great method of zooming in and out of things before cameras could use it themselves. Do it themselves. It's missing a wheel though, so it's blocking our way. Slides a wheel. Of powder they used in the olden days. Seems for filming. Alright. Pretty sure that's right. That's why it's directing such a high restricted job. If I get your hands blown off. Hmm? Sound right. But I'm not about to run off and research it. I don't think I want to bring you down, do I? Tree. The store seems to be from an ancient. The ancient are more boring. Finally, it's a mystery. way through. Not boring way through. the edge this thing. Let's start with the meteor. That's part of the meteor, right? It's monkey dude. He needs to be near the top. Yeah, this is going to take forever to do. I don't want to do the puzzle.
deal with that. Okay, I don't want to do that. I want you to jump on his back. Piggyback, thank you. Kills me instantly. Hold on, what? Now we're both stuck in here until the timer runs out. Oops, a daisy. We should make sure one of us on the other side of the door when I pull this lever. I think I have to solve that. I need to do something with that.
Why won't it just, uh... the sparks but it doesn't do anything. using it but it's not doing anything So I'm doing it, but it's not doing anything. Still nothing. Okay, I think I'm going to end the stream there for today. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll probably continue this game uh, tomorrow. So I'll see you guys then, and hopefully I'll figure out this puzzle by that point because I clearly don't know what I'm doing here right now and there's nothing else that I can really look at here right yeah I'm gonna end it there for today thanks for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time